I don't think that golfers swing hard enough. When I say swing hard enough, I actually mean they don't swing fast enough. I don't think golfers are using the top end of their spectrum for their maximum speed. I don't think they're tapping into their true power through the golf ball because they're being too careful. Now there is a difference between swinging hard and swinging fast. If I swing hard, I might use my body to pull that club into the ball and get in some really bad angles that don't help the ball get propelled to the target. Swinging faster is a different story. If I swing faster, I'm trying to get that club head to get rammed through the ball. I'm not trying to exert myself from the body as much. So I see a lot of golfers pull the club down loads, leave the face open, hit some clunky shots into the ground and not actually launch the golf ball. What I would rather see is faster golf swings where the club head gets flung through the golf ball. I don't want to go at the golf ball. I want to go through the golf ball. The more that club gets along the turf instead of into the turf, the less resistance there is on the strike and on the potential distance of the shot, as well as consistency. So if I use all of my might and all of my effort, I feel really strong and powerful. If I bring that club into the ball, if I go like this, I feel really powerful, but that is not functional. So please consider this. Now motion that I like is the thought of throwing the golf club throw. I'm not getting stuck in the mud. I'm not getting stuck in the turf. I'm getting through the area of the golf. If I'm throwing the club and I get through the area of the golf ball and I miss strike it, I'm still going to get that ball launching towards the green and towards the target. If I miss strike it, I'm still going to get most of the shot that I was trying to generate. If I swing through the golf ball, I've hit that thin, but I've still got it going up and towards the target. And sometimes the thin shots aren't actually that bad. They might cost you a few yards, but they're still going at it. If you're gonna miss the target, miss closer to the target. Now, sometimes people swing slow and smooth and they think that is the success that they get on some shots where they swing really smooth, really slow. Yes, they strike it nice, but it's because the body stayed centered, they rotated very well. It's not because of a lack of effort. It's not because they've been so smooth. It's because their body stayed in place in my opinion. When that golfer tries to give it the beans and they try and give it more speed, more pace, more effort, and they get something that maybe slides or jumps, they get those excessive movements from that effort into the ball, that's when the problems can come in. So a good drill for this is to put your heels touching each other, and then I wanna be able to hit the ball as hard as I can from my heels touching and maintain my balance. If I can get to a stage where I can touch my heels, stay standing up when I've hit it as hard as I can, then I'm gonna be in pretty good shape. If you put your heels together and you swing it as hard as you can and you fall over, no problem. We just know we're trying to get to that end goal of being able to do that. When we put our heels together, it forces us to rotate. I can't slide my weight back and forth, so I can't fall off the wagon as easily. I feel like there's three layers of a golf swing. There's aggressive, which might be too much, which is where you jump out of shape, you fall over a little bit, and that's what causes the bad shots, the bad strikes, the bad directions. Then we fall into something assertive, where I get through the ball without holding back, but I maintain balance. You could call it controlled aggression. And then there's complacent, where I'm trying so hard to be smooth and rhythmical that I just don't get through the ball and I don't get a good shot. I can't get my maximum potential if I'm too relaxed on the ball. So feet together, heels touching, swing hard, find your balance. And I've just hit the same shot as the other one. Nice. Give that a go, see how you get on. Don't hold back. 